like these, we are missing in Jamaica. Now, red food, and right now, yeah, man. I don't know. Okay. Yes, people. Welcome back, my people. Welcome back to uh, another vlog. Big up on yourself, man. If you guys are new to the channel, thank you guys for coming here. If you guys are re returning subscribers, I want to thank you guys also for continuing supporting. Seeing it's really early in the morning. I am heading to a hockey tree that's in my yard, but the yard is kind of open and majority of the time people just pay random visits to this aki tree without any permission so you know the saying early bird catches the most worm seeing so we just have to get up early and pick as much as i need not as much as I can because if I can pick and leave for somebody else to get some then that's what I'm gonna do seeing and right now already I can see a few open ones yeah man if you guys don't know this is our national dish seeing and I'll be having this aki with some um salt mackerel a lot of people rather the salt fish the aki and the salt fish is our national dish but i find the aki and salt mackerel tasting a whole lot better right so i'm just picking what i can pick with my hand before i actually get into this tree so yeah that is what's going on here yeah man and, and people this fruit as we call it as you can see these ones here aren't open this is what it, it looks like when it's fit to be eaten believe it or not this is a poisonous fruit so you have to make sure that whenever you are um, going to consume this you have to make sure that it is fit to be eaten before you do so seeing it can be very very harmful to you if you consume this without it naturally being open and the, the, the gases which are inside are naturally released in some country i've also heard that they use this fruit for witchcraft and black magic and all of that but here in jamaica we don't do anything like that with it it's food to us yeah man and it tastes really good a lot of people travel from all over the world to experience what this thing tastes like and i've never heard a bad review in terms of this fruit so um it is not eating like this you have to actually this is the aki that we need this other part isn't eat edible so you just have to remove all of the aki from inside see this part is not good these are what we need and people ever since burial ever since the hurricane i have been having a constant fight with mosquitoes which i've never had at this location not that i i, I never had mosquitoes here uh, here i never used to be fighting them so much you know and these ones are bigger so yeah man anyway stay tuned I'm gonna get a stick and I'm gonna get in that tree and I'll give you guys an update after this, alright? Big up on yourself.
Yeah man people as you guys can see I am in the Aki tree and right now the sun is just peeking through the bushes so yeah the sun just start to rise people it is things like these we are missing in Jamaica yeah man I don't know if I can't remember the last time when we were going on an Aki tree when we go to the road and see a man sell Aki or when we just pee a man to go pick the Aki mm -hmm. there is a whole lot I don't need all of them I just need what can serve me Mm -hmm. That's why they say Jamaica bless you know. How many country right now me have breadfruit up there and I have breadfruit on the tree right now and I'm here picking Aki. That's a full course meal. And it's it it, it go cost me a thing. More than just some a little time to pick the necessary stuff that I need. Yeah. More Aki. And I'm just sitting in one place. Mm -hmm. So, more aki. I tell the people, we are missing out on a lot of these things. The land of food and water, man. Yep. So, big up on yourself. As soon as I'm down, I'll give you guys an update. Yeah, man. I guess I have to change spot now and see if I can get at least an next more dozen, and then I'm out. I don't need to strip the tree. I'm gonna leave some for anybody else who needs aki later on today. So, big up on yourself again. I'm just embracing true natural beauty, you know? The sunrise. Yeah, the sun is actually rising at yeah, the distance, you know? Nice and lovely day today. Well, so far. So, when I told you guys, we have. breadfruit and right now I am just standing on my roof yeah man I'm on my roof right now but I don't eat it I don't eat breadfruit so most of the breadfruit on this tree I just give them away the others when nobody now asks for breadfruit they just ripe and fall in the yard I make a miss yeah and if you ask why I don't eat breadfruit, I don't even know. I just don't like the taste. You know, everybody have their own taste. And breadfruit, nothing am I liking. Don't know why. Mm -hmm. Especially when it when it um turn. You see when it turn, oh, too sweet. I don't like sweety food. Yeah, ma yes, people. See what I'm going on now? Yeah man All of me Aki Has been clean Meaning by clean I've Removed The seeds And a lot of the Aki has been wasted because um, We've been having a bit of rain on and off And If The water is trapped Inside If rain water is trapped inside this part with the aki inside the water will stay there and it will tend to get the aki all soft and mushy mushy yeah I wouldn't like that so I had to throw out a whole lot 
of the Aki but nevertheless I still have enough more than enough and I still left a ton load on the tree which of course is right there so what I'm gonna do now I'm going to organize some onion some scallion and stuff and I'm going to boil this I'm going to cook this before we actually fry it up with the mackerel I have the mackerel soaking in water overnight to remove a lot of the salty content because you do know it's pickled mackerel just like salt fish it's pickled fish yeah man but you can't eat it with all that salt in it it's just too much so I have the mackerel inside in the kitchen being soaked overnight so I'm gonna taste a bit of it and see if it's edible or I need to remove more of the salt if more of the salt needs to be removed I'm just gonna I'm just gonna boil it for a bit maybe about a, um, five minutes or so and just pour off the boiling water which that is a process we use in Jamaica to remove salty contents from whether it's pickled pork pickled fish you name it see just boiling water so yeah that is that and I'll keep you guys up to date big up on yourself again yes people so that time of day you know all right let me show you how I go on. This is water with just a little bit of salt to cook the aki. This is the pickled or salt mackerel. I slightly pinch off a little piece of it and taste it, and it was a bit still too salty. So here I am giving it a boil just to remove the remaining or the excess salt you don't want it too salty steam you still want it you can eat now i could have gone ahead and cook this aki in the same pan here but people it's not something that i like to do whenever we jamaicans are cooking the, the, the salt fish and the aki we tend to boil them together all right Aki has its own taste, right? I do it sometimes, like if me the out, me run a bush boat or, or a bush pot then if I'm cooking while I'm at the bush or something or outdoor. It's somewhat easier, seeing, but believe me, Aki has its own taste. And if you don't know what you're doing, you can lose that taste. But a lot of people don't have that, that um, sense of taste for you know that Aki come with its own taste and when you pair it with something from an earlier stage like the cooking process right now this Aki needs to be cooked and get tenderized if I put this Aki in this pot with this salt mackerel right now and cook the Aki with it the Aki will absorb the taste from whether it's salt fish, pickled mackerel, whatever it is the aki will absorb that taste and when eating the meal the aki won't taste as delicious as if you would boil the aki by itself you understand the aki remains the aki taste remains within the aki saying yes it's cooked and it tenderized but it won't taste so much of the the, the salt mackerel so yes at the final stage you have to combine everything and give it a bit of stir fry but if you should take the aki from the, your frying pan and taste it you can still taste the aki taste within the aki you know too salty you know absorb too much of the salt fish or the the, the um salt mackerel in my case so we have to know these things so there are plenty of ways to, to do this but the best way is to just cook the aki by itself and then when you're going to stir fry them you stir fry them together and combine it that way the aki don't really absorb so much of the the the, the fish taste so yeah me like you can taste the, the the taste of aki because aki tastes really good i've never seen someone come to this country and doing a food review on aki and saltfish and it's a bad review so if you guys have never tried it, you guys need to come and join me and come and go and try this. So um, 
what I'm doing now, I'm waiting for the water to actually come to a boil before I add the aki. And yes, right now, in my living room, I am here about to kickstart the final phase of this renovation process. So, um, yeah, so me have a bag of cement, them sandstone. This is my living area, guys. This is my living room. My couch was just right here, so a few a few weeks back. But everything now is packed up outside, and all of this is stemming from just a simple tiling process, which some bad work went on before the previous tiles were laid. And when I took up the the, the previous tile to have it retiled. I see all of the nonsense that was done underneath with the concrete structure and me have to fix that before I put on a new tile so hence being the reason you guys are seeing this place like this and guys dust a kill me the dust from all of the tile cutting and the stone and the concrete so I constantly have to be washing and cleaning but that's fine as soon as all of, the, all of this is done me go give place a proper clean down I understand so big up on yourself stay tuned i'll keep you guys up to date out here yes people so the madness has already begun yeah man the madness has already begun i just went to the store to grab a few things and people the prices look here look at this i got one small sweet pepper and two half the tomatoes four hundred dollars man i saw this coming from a mile i could tell you that and it is scorching hot outside right now so maybe i just head to the river as soon as i am done here um i did get a one one pair we we'll go check my bridge and I'm see it under the tree and in Joseph Itechi. I was also trying to get some green bananas, but majority of the banana trees due to hurricane burial then blow down. So I found a tree lined with some bananas on there. They weren't quite fit, but I took the fittest ones that me see on there so yeah people me see up something we show now see me have the salt mackerel all cleaned and deboned i've removed as much as the bone as i possibly could now it's then two piece here this is the center bone you see in salt fish and in salt mackerel this thing here cause a whole lot of vexation in a whole heap of household all across Jamaica. People, I don't know what is so sens sensational about the, the, the taste in this thing. It, it's not, you can't swallow it because of bone. So, just by chewing on this and getting the, the remaining salt that's in that, believe me, it's really tasty because. I just tried a little piece and it just bring back some memories of me I tell you say. It bring back a whole heap of memories from when me at a, a, a younger age. Yeah man. Anyways, my aki has already been cooked. I've already washed the pot, added back some water in there. And over here so I've already need my dough to make the dumpling them, I have banana this and I have a piece of yam this so what I'm going to do is currently just add the dumplings to the pot and the yam and the banana and everything and then I just, while that's being cooked, I just chop up these seeds Alright so people, hope I hope this is the grand finale so I can actually come out of the kitchen to go cool down because it is a hot day, I had to close the door due to the wind that is blowing seeing and the dust anyways um let me get you guys up to date now don't gonna go and boil let me get my fork 
dump in a go and boil. In a this, I have a few pieces of yellow yam. Now, as for the green bananas, I just had to wash them. I cut the top and the bottom and I marked it as if I am going to peel it. But these bananas, they are on the younger side. They can't peel. So what I'm going to do is just add them same way. Add them in a pot same way. So it will cook. See? And it will release from the skin, but the skin will kind of keep it intact. So the banana, no? the, the banana, the actual banana, no, um, break up and break apart. So it is time to get yaki and the sawfish out of the way. So I am going to set up my camera so that you can, you guys can have the best seat in the house so stay tuned for that i'll keep you guys up to speed stay tuned all right grand finale for the aki you know first i'm gonna go in with a little bit of vegetable oil see then i'm gonna add like a quart full of coconut oil this is just going to enhance the flavor all right now i did already pre chop all of the spices and seasons that i want to use this have um onion tomato um scotch bonnet sweet pepper garlic scallion and thyme Right now, we can make nothing waste, nothing can waste, nothing on that sweat. Yeah, and the aroma, people, are ready. The aroma is here. Alright, so I'm just gonna let this saute a bit in this oil so that all of this flavors can release before I go in with the salted or the pickled mackerel first. Yep. Alright. So yeah we're just gonna give it about a minute and let all of this seasoning them salty and all the flavors them you know, and then me will show you what I go on. Alright, so what I go on. Nice. I love it. So, now I'm just going to go in with the salt mackerel. Alright, I'll use salt fish. Now is the time. Right now, this is terrible as it is right now. Nice and lovely people. Because this is already cooked and this must stay intact as saltfish would. I am not going to be frying up this for too long. Unlike saltfish, saltfish kind of stay intact more when it's cooked. For salt mackerel, I can't say the same. So, in with the aki. And people, when I cook aki, I try my very best not to do too much of um, stirring because when I put my aki in shape, you know you can't get everything in shape, you know, but as much as I can, 
I try my very best to keep it in shape. Alright, so what I'm gonna do now is add I didn't have any pimento seeds, so there wasn't any need to fry up the pimento seeds in the oil. If you recall, I did blend my pimento to dust. Yeah, man, granulate this. So, what are the things that I'm doing? I have white pepper that's fine. I have a white pepper. I don't have it. 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 I Play with me like cats and a spray. Uh, cool, you don't you understand the time about me. You don't ever want to give me one. You don't ever want to set me free. You know I'm addicted to you. And it's twisted, you've been gifted with the evil voodoo. Got me coming back for more, even when I've been screwed. Dolls full of pins, pierce my heart straight through. I got issues in my head. I like you in my bed, but you keep me on red. Oh. Everything is like a test. I better not text or I'll come off desperate. What if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead? Maybe you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head, under my bed. Think you're something out of my mind. So if I play dead, will you regret everything that you did, that you said? I don't think you understand what you're doing, and my heart's black and blue from the bruising. I feel like when I'm with you, I'm losing. I feel like you think that it's amusing, sitting there gaslighting and confusing. Was it me? Is it me? Am I deluded? I'm the one who's always sorry, the conclusion Even though I offer all of the solutions I wish you loved me like I love you, it's stupid When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid I wish when I first saw you, I knew this When I'm with you, I feel so useless I feel diluted, my heart's been wounded Silhouettes of you are like a taunt Never really know just what you want with you, I don't ever feel yeah. calm. So. I could feel the sweat inside my palm. Play with me oh, like yeah. cats and a string. Don't you don't understand the pain of brain. Right, you don't so ever want to give me wings. No you don't ever want to set me free. But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead, maybe you'll Good. get. Yeah.